Israeli forces killed five Palestinians in an overnight raid in the occupied West Bank, including four fighters from the militant group Hamas. That's according to Israeli and Palestinian officials on Saturday. Hamas confirmed that four of the men killed during the raid near the city of Tal Qadam were from its Al-Qassam armed wing. The Palestinian Health Ministry said their bodies had been taken by the Israeli military. There was no information about the fifth man, whose body was too disfigured for immediate identification. During the raid, the Israeli army leveled a two-story house with a bulldozer in an operation that lasted more than 12 hours. According to Palestinian Health Ministry records, nearly 500 Palestinians have been killed by Israeli forces or Jewish settlers in the West Bank or East Jerusalem since October 7th. That's when Hamas militants attacked Israel, killing 1,200 people and abducting 252 others, according to Israeli tallies. Health authorities in the Hamas-ruled enclave say more than 34,000 Palestinians have been killed in Israel's seven-month-old assault on the Gaza Strip. Palestinians want the West Bank and Gaza, which Israel captured in the 1967 Middle East War, as the core of an independent state with East Jerusalem as its capital. U.S.-backed talks to reach an agreement between Israel and the Palestinians have been stalled for the past decade, but the Gaza War has raised pressure for a revival of efforts to reach a two-state solution. First Post puts the spotlight on Africa. We report from across the continent. Rewriting the narrative. Stories of hope and progress. Amid coups. Conflicts. And climate crisis. The challenges are many, but so are the opportunities. Trying to do what benefits the majority of uh, citizens. Tracking the world's second largest continent. Launching soon. First Post Africa.